Hey everyone, or welcome to my channel! Woo! If you are new here, my name is Laura. I am the founder and owner of That's So Laura UK, and we make handmade hair accessories and resin jewelry. Soon to be a whole lot more. Ooh, hope you enjoyed this week's video! Good morning, it's Wednesday, and I am filming again. Um, <laughs> I am full of cold today. Oh, it's been a heavy weekend last weekend and I think it was just everything catching up on me. Um, a mixture of overdoing it at the gym, overdoing it at work, overdoing it in general and not sleeping enough. So a last name full of cold this morning. But it's okay because I've got my coffee and in this I've got some matcha powder from the lovely Pink Panda Matcha. Um, her name's Laura, she's lovely. Um, she recommended that I have this in lattes because I love coffee but also it's super good for your health and it's full of antioxidants. So have one of these every morning um, and hoping for the best. Um, but yeah, oh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a week this week. Uh, I'm just about to go in and set some resin because on Friday morning, well Friday, sort of late morning, early afternoon, I'm heading over to the Palm House for two days, um, Friday and Saturday to set up there, which I'm really looking forward to. It's one of my favorite markets. Um, I know I say that about every market because they're all really awesome, but yeah. <laughs> um, so I've got a lot to do. I've got some resin set in. I've got a lot of orders to go through today and get them sorted because some custom fabric arrived yesterday. And then I've got some prepping for a wholesale order to do um, lots of other exciting bits. I'm gonna let you in on some little things that I'm doing later on this year, later on this week. So yeah, today I'm gonna have a little go at pouring some resin into this mold. So this is the one I made myself out of silicone. Um, it's not too bad, it's my first mold, so it's got a couple of issues with it, like some, the way some of the sides are formed, um, like here, and here, and here, and some of the way some of these are formed, but you know what, I'm just gonna pour some in anyway, and just see how it looks, because it's a good idea to sort of trial as you go. Like this is my first trial mold, these will be my first trial resin pieces, so I can sort of see how they look, and like what I need to do to adjust when I'm doing the mold. Because um, hopefully next week I can start getting some acrylic pieces cut so that I can have tons and tons of trees like this just absolutely covered in moulds that I have made myself with multiples, like multiples of these, multiples of these, these, because these are some of my best selling shapes. Um, oh, and these are some new ones which I'm trying. I've not done like a loop yet. I'm not really sure how I'm going to get it to work because they are quite thin. Let me show you. So, yeah, some I made earlier. So they are lovely and they show up really well, and the shape's lovely, but they're dead thin. So I think what I'm gonna have to do is add like a stud and a jump ring and see how they hang. So they hang on like a stud on your ear instead, because I just wouldn't get anything through that that would make it worthy of sticking it in your ear. So yeah, that's the plan for that one. Similar with this, although this is thinner again. So this is super, super thin, like same sort of thickness, but it's like tiny. It's tiny, so I'm not really sure like what I'm gonna do with that. But you know what? We'll give it a go. Oh, and here comes trouble. What are you doing? Are you hopping? Hop. 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 So I demolded these this morning. Um, really, really pleased with them. Look at them, they're so cute. They are so pretty. Um, yeah, super pleased. And these are the ones that came out of my mold that I made. You know what? Not too shabby. Need a little bit of sort of neatening up around the edges, which I can do with my little fake Dremel. 
um, especially like so these ones where you can see like where it's gone slightly so that's the bit of the mold so it would have come out like that so it's gone slightly over the mold but it's one of them that I can't fix but yeah otherwise really please look at these prints I'm so keen to see what these look like they're still a bit floppy at the moment they're still drying um yeah what these look like but dead pleased with this mold I think I'm gonna have a little look uh next week at making bulk molds and maybe even acrylic plates so that I can pull the mold into the plate and then we use the plate afterwards and make tons and tons of molds so one day I can just have a tray just follow them that's the plan it's half past days in the morning it is Friday and I've got a purple face <laughs> Sounds says a lot like a Batman villain. Um, I did my hair last night, so it's just gone a little bit on my face. Must have rubbed off onto the pillow, but it is looking a fabulous bunch of colours. Um, oh, sorry, I'm just rejoining you. Um, I've really not felt well the last few days. I had a really bad cold. I'm still a bit swollen, a bit puffy, but I'm feeling loads better today. So today is the first day of Palm House. Pop up in the Palm House. So I'm excited for that. I will take you with me. Oh, show you where I'm going to the setup, the usual. Um, yeah, catch you a little bit. It's two minutes past eleven, and I am on my way to the pump house in Sefton Park. Um, coloured my hair, so it's looking pretty nice today. Also wearing a dress I made. Um, <laughs> really happy about that too. Because to be quite honest, I've been thinking about doing it for the business for a little while, so. We will see. Hmm. Um, but yeah, it's absolutely roasting. I'm still full of colds. My voice sounds terrible and I keep coughing, so that's not attractive, but life must go on. Um, yeah, I'm on my way. I will see you there. It's quarter to nine and it is Sunday morning. And I have not filmed anything for what feels like two or three days. Um, it's been really like crazy busy. I have not been feeling well at all this week. Um, you probably hear it in my voice. I've had a terrible cold. Um, thankfully not COVID. Um, loaded tests like every day in the run up to this event. Um, but yeah, the filming's been a bit, <laughs> a bit lax this week. But um, I've been at the Palm House for the last two days and today is my final day, um, which I am looking forward to. Hopefully it's a really good day. The weather has been incredible. Um, the only downside to that is that I've been in a greenhouse for essentially a greenhouse for two days. Um, I've got a bit of sunburn. I've had to put lighter makeup on my face today because it's just been a bit sore. And my arms are a nice pink lobster color. Um, and it meant I couldn't wear one of my other dresses that I made um, because it was it has a slightly like cropped longer sleeve, like a three quarter length sleeve. Um, and it's lovely, it's dead floaty, but it's just too hot. So I've even got like a slightly lower cut dress on just to give my chest a bit of space to breathe. And I've got dead floaty sleeves on in this dress as well today. Um, but yeah, so. I am heading there, I'm gonna try and do a little bit of filming today. I'm going over a little bit early so that I can just plonk my stuff, have a walk around, do a bit of filming, um, show you guys what I'm up to, and then, yeah, do a little bit of shopping, although I shouldn't. Um, <laughs> but yeah, otherwise, have a fabulous day.
it's 10 past 10 and I'm at the farmhouse. Ooh, look at it behind me. Oh, it's glorious. Um, I'm just having a little wander around because I've got a little bit of time before I start. So I shall take you on a little wander, show you some of the fabulous stalls here today. Well, what an absolute weekend that was. <laughs> um, it is currently 20 to seven and I am all packed up, all packed back into the car and on my way home. It always makes me really sad. Um, I absolutely adore this event. It's one of my faves of the year. Um, but yeah, all done adjusted. Sold out of tons. Um, barely got any hair clips left, barely got any headbands left. I'm probably gonna have to close down the website for like a week or two just so I can get some stock made and some stuff up. Um, but yeah. It's been awesome. Um, I'm exhausted. I'm gonna go home and relax for the evening and then tomorrow I'm gonna have a much needed day off away from everything. Can't wait. It's nice, it's fresh. And even though I am uploading today, I just wanted to come and just be like, ah, it's been a week. <laughs> um, I didn't get around to filming much this week, just gone. But next week I have written down absolutely everything I want to film. So hopefully it'll be a little bit more for you, especially because I've got some other bits and bobs happening and a little bit more time to breathe as well. Um, but yeah, I mentioned there's some awesome things coming up. I placed my first wholesale fab recorder today. Really excited. I've got like, hundreds of meters of fabric coming at some point um i don't know where i'm gonna put it <laughs> but yeah i hope you enjoyed this week's little mini vlog um hopefully we'll be back up to full speed ahead next week um but yeah otherwise see you soon